Riley Sorolla coming at you with a new food review. Today, I'm in Amsterdam and I'm going to be showcasing Sazanka, a teppanyaki restaurant. Stay tuned because at the end of this episode, I'm going to let you know whether to give this place a hit or a miss. Boom. So we had this complimentary dish, the salmon. It, uh, you could tell the way it was fresh, it was almost like it had been caught that morning. Absolutely soft, delicate, fresh, with a mild smoky flavour that went well with the sake sauce, which was quite sweet. The courgette it added that nice crunch, delivering a powerful contrast. I'm just getting started. So with the mains, the salmon with teriyaki sauce and a lamb rack, heavyweights. Absolute heavyweights as mains. Like, you can tell that a lot of love and kindness was sewn into such food that extended beyond the chef's culinary skills. Like, <laughs> that meat and fish came from a very homely place. This place gets a five out of five. The customer service at Sazanka was world class. Like, there was nothing to fault them for. They were very courteous and they tended to our every need, but more importantly, in a timely fashion. So on that basis, customer service gets a five out of five. Dining at Sazanka was a breathtaking experience. From the decor to the lights out action when they were flaming the grill, it was outstanding. This is fine dining with a splash of entertainment. My only criticism would be the fact that Perhaps there was no music to add to the mood, but that's me just being extremely picky. I will give Ambience a four and a half out of five. Right, this place was squeaky clean. Nothing stood out that was out of place. 
they didn't actually have a restroom, but uh, this restaurant was based in a hotel. So that's, you know, that's not out of uh, character. This place gets a five out of five. We left this place happy, satisfied, but most importantly, full. To the top of my head, the bill came to, uh, it was just about, just over 110 euros, I believe. Not to forget, we did have sparkling wine. So with that, two fantastic dishes. I think the value is pretty decent. I would give it a four out of five. I would definitely recommend this place. It's an outstanding place. No wonder it has a Michelin star. So um, yeah, that's the end of my review. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Comment below, share the video, and if you haven't already, subscribe to my channel. If you want to learn more about Sazanka, I've left their link in, in the description box below. You'll also find my Facebook, Instagram, and guys, I now have Twitter, so follow me on Twitter. Check out my other videos right there. So, till next time, peace!